It is one of the most iconic pieces of furniture created in all times, known in its commercial name LC4 or the Chaise Longue. Designed at the Le Corbusier Atelier in Paris in 1928, this icon tells a story of a fascination with machine edge aesthetics and with the possibility of creating a chair that perfectly mirrors the body's natural curves. Relaxing machine, in the words of Le Corbusier. Its movable frame adjusts along the base from upright to full recline, providing a variety of sitting angles. The design was signed by three members of the French avant-garde movement. Le Corbusier, his cousin and partner Pierre Jeanneret, and Charlotte Perriand, who became known for the memorable photo of her reclining on one of the first models wearing a daringly short skirt. Just like in his buildings, the Swiss-born Paris-based architect sought to liberate furniture design from traditions. He wanted to create pieces for the same homes he called machines for living in. The same clarity, rationality, and simplicity, the focus on clean, spare hygiene and perfection were present in his furniture design as in those buildings he designed in the glorious 20s. With its chrome-plated steel frame and leather cover, the chaise longue was luxurious and sensational from the day it was born. While the first model was produced by craftsmen under the supervision of Charles Perrian for the exhibition at the 1929 Paris Autumn Salon, it quickly went into production. In the following year, the Parisian branch of Tonnette began manufacturing the chaise under a contract signed with the three designers. But in 1964, Le Corbusier signed an exclusive worldwide rights license with Casina, and the Italian furniture makers produced the chaise longue, along with other models created at the Le Corbusier's atelier ever since. In my recent visit to Casina's showroom in Soho last week, I saw the new version of the chaise longue called LC4CP. This limited edition is a product of a new collaboration between Casina, which provides the structure, and Louis Vuitton. The luxury brand has contributed its expertise in saddlery craftsmanship, enabling this unique and stylish model to have the natural hide leather attached directly onto the structure without the original mattress. It reminded me of the Louis Vuitton handbags that I love so much. With this new magnificent model, the story of the chaise longue is closing a circle. Charlotte Perriand loved traveling, and while working with Louis Vuitton, admired the crafted spaces inside the famed luxurious trunks. She wished to have the same craftsmanship attached to her own creations.